Hey guys, welcome into this new video. In today's tutorial, let's take a look of how we can trade it and a specific token into another one. Now, if you want to send from one uh, token into the cryptocurrency or the currency they're using in your bank account or in your uh, country, all you want to do is to go into our wallet first of all and go into the Aave view here. So what you guys are going to see is the total estimate balance that you have here collected here and what you guys want to find is the fiat and spot token. So now that you find your fiat and spot uh, account, you can change whether that would be your token. Uh, let's say in this case, you want to look and filter the USDT token. That would be the FIFA token. And what I want to do is to select the option that says convert. So now that we convert here, we can uh, change a lot of tokens here. Let's see if we can trade this into heroes. So as you can see, here's the EUR uh, token. So I can select, let's say I want to trade USDT here from USDT to EUROS. So I'm going to preview my conversion. And once I make this conversion, what I want to do is to take a look at the price here. This is the price of one USDT equals to this amount of EUROS. So and the inverse price, this is uh, the total amount of USDT. So I'm not going to be receiving this token. Or in our case, this is the currency of our bank. So after you go into refresh, so you can see the new price, just go ahead and select continue. So you can be creating the conversion. In my case, it says insufficient balance, please fund your account. But you guys just go ahead and make the refresh. So you can have this already into your wallet. So now that you have those transactions done, you can go into your wallet, fiat and spot once again. And where it says search coin, you can uh, let's disable this one and you can look for the heroes token, which is right in here. And you can see that your token is now available in here. Just in case you are not sure that your transaction has been done, you can go into your transaction history to take a look at your latest transaction. And if your transaction go into the status and says completed, this means that you might be able to see the conversion right away into your account. If not, you can select the option that says deposit hasn't arrived, click here, and you can see the option that Binance has to offer you in order to help you with the transaction, guys. So let me know if you have any question. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel, guys, if you want to see more about Binance. Thank you for watching the video, and I'll see you guys next time.